What is going on everybody? Welcome to the Almost Daily Paul. My name is Paul, of course. And today I wanna to address a couple of questions that people have been asking about not only the, the new job, but uh, some of the stuff that we're gonna be do, doing moving forward. So first off is, you know, I was talking about how many miles I've been walking in a day, which is right now between five and seven and a half miles a day on the, on the high side. And people are like, well, how many miles are you driving a day? And I have to say right now I'm driving zero miles. This is my fourth week here at Walt Disney World as a cast member and I have yet to step foot in a bus as a bus driver. I haven't started training yet. I am just doing what they call audience control and audience control is just talking to guests and making sure they're getting on the right buses and going in the right direction. So. That's what we've been doing right now. They are in the middle of hiring a boatload of bus drivers and they just don't have the trainers to be able to train the bus drivers. So we're in this kind of waiting queue as is common at Disney. You're always waiting in lines, right, at Disney? And uh, I'm waiting in the line right now to be trained as a bus driver. So the majority of my job is walking around here at the Animal Kingdom bus loading area and just hanging out with guests, talking to guests and putting a smile on people's faces or at least trying to. So that's why I am doing zero miles right now and walking so much because in this little area, even though it is a fairly small area, we're able to put on a lot of miles from just walking from bus stop to bus stop, talking to people, walking people to the places they need to go sometimes and doing that sort of thing. So that's been a lot of fun actually and interacting with guests has been great uh, for the most part. And secondly, people are asking, are we gonna to continue to do some travel videos? And yes, we are. We are going to do some travel stuff in, on and around Central Florida, and we will start uh, shooting some of those videos here in Central Florida on my days off once we get done with the stuff out of uh, Mexico, which should be over the next two or three videos that we're releasing there. So I know some people aren't, aren't into the whole Mexico thing. So, uh, you know, stay tuned. We are going to be having more coming from Central Florida and exploring this area. And there is a ton of stuff to do in the Orlando area for sure, at least in Central Florida from, from coast to coast. We're about an hour and a half to each coast, no matter whether you go east coast over to Melbourne and Port Canaveral. Canaveral or over to the west coast in the Tampa Clearwater area, Fort Myers, Fort Myers a little further south, but uh, the Tampa Clearwater area. So that's what's happening right now. Uh, as far as health stuff, everything's been good. I noticed over the last couple of days, my numbers have been starting to climb a little bit because I haven't been behaving myself as much. I have been slamming a lot of Dr. Pepper and eating some some processed stuff that I that I shouldn't have. Kind of testing the waters to see what's what's. Uh, you know, what's gonna make numbers come back. Nothing that's jumped, but I've noticed the things start to climb a little bit, so we're gonna ease off of that stuff again and stay where we are right now to keep those numbers in check because once they get too far out of whack, then it's just, you know, it's tough to get everything back in line again. So I'm going to try and remain in right, right around that 120 over 80 mark when it comes to blood pressure. And then here within the next month or two, I'm gonna go back and redo my blood tests just to see where my levels are when it comes to that stuff. So hopefully you guys are sticking with the program, getting out and walking and uh, eating better and doing all that sort of stuff so that we can hang out with our grandkids and kids a little bit longer, spend a little bit more time on this beautiful blue ball we call Earth and doing it for, for yourself mostly just to make sure that you can stick around and travel a little bit more. So. If you happen to make it into uh, you know Disney World in the next little while and you're at the Animal Kingdom, I will be in the bus loading area. So you can just stop by and say hello there. That's all I've got for this episode. If this is your first time here, it'd be awesome if you hung out with us a little bit, got to know us, and that means you gotta hit that subscribe button, click the little notifications bell so anytime a new video is put up, you'll get a notification of that. And go ahead and like this video if you so choose, and we will see you folks in another episode. Have a fantastic day wherever it is you are in the world. Bye now.